Hello everyone. In the previous video, we looked at the a problem statement on also a quick demo of the exercise as well. Uh, so in this video, uh, we will be looking at the APIs that are involved in completing the exercise. Uh, if you don't have an account in the SAP Gateway Demo System, uh, go ahead and create an account in the SAP Gateway Demo System. Uh, we will be using the APIs in the SAP Gateway Demo System to complete our exercise. Uh, so the first API that we will be using in our exercise uh, is a, a call to product set entity set. Uh, so we pass in the product ID uh, as the primary key. And when we do make a request to this endpoint, uh, we get details about this product ID. Uh, this also signifies that the product ID is in our database. Uh, if I do send an invalid product ID, uh, so X is an invalid product ID, uh, the response is of course going to be different. Uh, it says that uh, that there is no product with this uh, key. Uh, so this way uh, we can iterate through all the products and uh, make a call to this entity set. And then if there is an invalid product, then we can ignore that product uh, from further uh, processing. Uh, so once we have uh, once we have the list of valid products, uh, then what we want to do is um, uh, we want to get all the sales orders for that product. Uh, so this is an optional step uh, where I get the sales orders count. Uh, we won't be doing this in the iFlow, uh, but just to show that I'm, uh, just to show how many sales orders there are for this product, uh, I'm going to make a call. And you can see that there's about uh, 1,400 uh, uh, sales orders for this particular product. Um, and then uh, let me also get the sales orders for these products. Uh, so I should be getting 1,400 of these uh, sales orders. Uh, okay, so this is the entities, uh, this is the endpoint that I would uh, uh, make a call uh, to get all the sales orders for this particular product. And I would make the same call to all the valid products uh, that are sent uh, in the SOAP request. Uh, so now I would get a whole bunch of uh, sales orders for each product. Uh, now from the, uh, from the sales order, uh, now I want to make a call to get the sales order header uh, because the sales order header is where the uh, customer information is. Uh, so now I'm making a call. So I'm getting the sales orders uh, and the line item and going to get the, and make a call to get the sales order header. Uh, so I make a call to this endpoint right here uh, to get all the sales order headers. Uh, so in this case, I get the sales order header and you can see that uh, some Somewhere there, yeah, there's the customer ID. Uh, then I grab this customer ID and then I write it to the data store. Uh, so, uh, so this is the uh, these are the APIs that we will be using uh, to uh, complete our exercise, uh, and they're all from the SAP Gateway Demo System. Uh, so, if you don't have an account in the SAP Gateway Demo System, uh, please go ahead and create an account in the SAP Gateway Demo System. Okay, uh, see you in the next uh, video.